So I just got Star Citizen. Um, I did fire it up a second ago, first time ever. But I realized it was on uh, 1024 by 768. I had no idea games, brand new games, still started and changed it back to, uh, or to 1920 by. I'm hoping everything works just fine. Um, I don't see why it wouldn't. Now, Bandicam saying I'm only getting uh, about 16, 17 frames a second, but I know when I'm recording it does drop significantly. So anyway, let's go check out the um, the Cutlass by Drake. Picked this up for $110. It was the package on Star Citizen, which gets you into the Alpha, the Beta, and uh, the dogfighting module, obviously the hangar module, because that's what we're in. So uh, looking around here, looks like we've got... Uh, I don't know what that is. That could be guns, refueling, ducks, I'm not sure. Landing gear, same thing on this side. The cockpit uh, from here looks like it has two seats. Some sort of uh, thrusters here. I guess landing thrusters, I'm not really sure. And giant engines in the back and more landing gear. Alright, here's access to the cargo bay. Oh look, a toilet. It's always uh, good to have one of those on long trips. You never know when you're going to need it. Uh, cargo, I'm not sure. I guess you can put stuff behind that. Maybe they're beds. Uh, yeah, it actually looks like a bed. So this looks very different than the other ships I've been seeing. Uh, as it's very rugged, uh, a lot of the other beds have um, lockable beds so you can sleep, I guess, for long journeys without worrying about somebody coming on your ship and killing you. This clearly doesn't have that. Maybe it's an upgrade. I'm not sure. Uh, these here might be some sort of docking things. I know the ship comes with docking capabilities. Um, so you can board and attack and do whatever you want to do. Um, so I'm guessing those might be it, or maybe it's right here, and you get above them and come down uh, from the top or something. I'm not sure. Um, this must be the Class 4 uh, weapon. You can uh, have somebody sit here and man the gun, uh, which doesn't appear to be working yet. No, there's nothing that uh, allows you to get up there, but still, that's that's pretty awesome nonetheless. Not sure what these are, maybe some sort of attachment, uh, no idea. Some sort of uh, panel, apparently it's 74 degrees in here. So, two seats. Kind of staggered off to the left here, I guess so you can walk by. It doesn't appear you can get in the second seat right now. But the first seat, uh, yes, looks like you can use that. So let's hop in. Alright. Clicking all the buttons, nothing seems to be happening. So, yeah, I'm guessing nothing can really uh, function right now. You can look around pretty well. I imagine this would be pretty awesome with the Oculus Rift whenever they get that working. So that appears to be it. It's a pretty sweet ship for $110. Um, all things considered, you spend more on Battlefield 4 and Premium. And uh, the game is certainly going to be better. Star Citizen is going to be better than Battlefield 4. I would hope so. So there you have it. This is the Drake Cutlass for $110 in default configuration. One little thing they did say was that we are getting the hangar that will be in an asteroid, and I guess that's more for uh, pirates and uh, stuff like that.